What's up guys? We're just gonna watch the Horizon Forbidden West state of play trailer or gameplay reveal that came out today. Um, let's go. Have you seen the first game before? Just clips, not the actual. Game. Okay. Well, we should uh, probably replay that actually. Mm -hmm. That'd be a good play. I need to. They need to patch it as well. I think. What do you think? I think they'll probably do it after this one is. We need a we out. need a sixty frames patch for the original Horizon because it, it's come out on PC and it's sixty frames. Ah, cheek. So yeah, PS Five Horizon patch one. Uh, patch for the first game, please. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's start the trailer. Let's see what this game looks like. I just think it's coming out. No idea. Hopefully this year. I've heard it's this year. I'm trying to put the glasses on for this. I hope it's this year, but no doubt they'll probably delay it. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Matthijs de Jonge. I'm the game director on Horizon Forbidden West. Last year we revealed our ambitious new project, and since then the team has continued to make great progress on the development of the game. We are very excited and honored to give you an update in this state of play. And in the countdown video leading up to this moment, you have already seen glimpses of the Forbidden West. But now we have something truly special for you. Almost 14 minutes of gameplay captured on PlayStation 5. And you don't have to wait any longer. Let's get right to it. Nice, so it's captured on the actual PS5. So it should. So it's not like a, a PC, super PC, like rendering it, it's actually on the PS5. Easy, easy. It's okay. You're safe now. Right here. Look at facial expression. Mm. See wrinkles and everything. Wait, what happened? Where's Erend? Ambush. Ruins are crawling with raiders. They hit our camp hard. We ran and they chased us down. This is like a movie. Was away from camp, scouting. That's the still graphical fidelity they've they've got now. Wow. Raiders got machines on their side. Claw striders. You should go after Aaron. If they find him before you do, who knows what they'll do to him? No, I. You're injured. I have to. Uh, don't worry about me. I'll make my own way out. Is this in engine? I don't think this is CG. I think this is actually in the game engine. Yeah. Yeah, this is the actual game. This is game. This is the actual game. But that even looks still. crazy. That looks crazy. It still looks like a movie. Look at all the detail in the environment. It's beautiful. Oh, look at these little bits. Wow. And apparently this is still coming out on PS4. I, I don't know for sure, but I'm sure they said it's a um, a cross-gen title. Oh! I'm 
need to get clear. I do want to replay the first one again, actually. But then... I always like feel like I should hold out in case they release a patch, like The Last of Us 2. So I was going to replay that again, lucky I didn't, because they just released a patch. Well, kind of holding out to see if they do a patch. They'll it. probably do a patch so, okay. if this has been released. You know, like they did with The Last of Us. The Last of Us 2 came out and then they now they just have to give up. No, they've just patched the last of us too. Oh, it's the last of us too. Yeah. Oh, they remastered the last of us. Yeah, but that, that was that was done way before oh. last of us two came out. Mm. But there's rumours that they're gonna remake oh, the first one. That's what I think they're doing. I probably am. Oh my god, look how beautiful it is through the water! The story was really good in the first one. Good story. But there's a lot of reading, you've got to read a lot of the, um, like the audio logs and things like that. You've got to listen to all the audio logs and diary notes and things like that. But it's worth it now. Yeah, it is actually. You get a good, good depth to the story. <laughs> I hope they do a performance mode in this as well because I like that what they do in most of the games now they've got like a graphic mode, graphics mm -hmm. mode and a performance mode. You know like a Miles Morales. Mm -hmm. I have friends, okay? And not just the ones you slaughtered. But when they come looking for me, there's gonna be trouble. <laughs> Close? They're just laughing. You guys wouldn't be laughing. I have my hammer. You know, get moving. I mean, it looks really good, but so far it's kind of like just more of the same. Mm. Which is not a bad thing, really. Thank you, Al. I wonder if they'll release this one on PC as well. The first game came out on PC. Did it? Like, okay. yeah, like recently. Yeah, because I do. it was exclusive to PS4 for ages, like, uh, like three years maybe. Raiders said they were heading for the old bridge. Maybe I can cut them off. Hmm. 
Better it's a lot down here to probably really go way. out and buy like new games and consoles and things that were not oh. coming out so that's why we were like well let's put things on to PC I don't know I just think they want more money to be honest <laughs> <laughs> I know people can't get PS5 so that would be a good thing for people that can't get hold of PS5 mm. if they've got a, a, a decent PC that can play it then yeah I guess you're right that's more people that can play the game but there's the bridge probably have to upgrade the, the graphics card for this game <laughs> I think and that's I hard to. to get there first. That's probably harder to get than a PS5. Oh wow! Look at her little glider. Oh, that looks really cool. Technology in this game is like in the future, but kind of like it's got like a in the past kind of feel. With it's like it's in a different time completely. Like, way ahead of me. That should do it. She just links that to her like little electronic thing. What's this avatar? So she like way ahead. took control of it. Mm. It's like avatar, it's really an avatar, isn't it? She is Link. They took that from Zelda. <laughs> Time to finish this. Hey, Lord. <laughs> Glad to see me. Now you bet. Uh, uh, I owe you another one. Come on. Even there, look at that. Uh, that looks mm. crazy. This time, I have a present for you. Oh, oh, oh. I found it, Emily. Huh? What'd you send me for? Right before the Raiders got me. You did good. Now, let's see where this thing will take us. That tech. <laughs> so I'm wondering what that little triangle thing was at the side of the head. It's a chip. Mm. Well, 
always said a storm was coming. Yeah. And it's almost here. Looks like CG, but that's actually, like, I'm sure that's in engine. That's like the actual graphic. There's only one way to find out. Mm. So there you have it. The first gameplay footage from Horizon Forbidden West running on PlayStation 5. We hope you are as excited about it as we are. Gameplay deep dive. While we have you here, we would like to spotlight some of the new elements you have just seen in our gameplay capture. And to help with that, please welcome Ben McCaw, Narrative Director on Horizon Forbidden West. Thanks, Matthijs, and hello to all our viewers. Horizon Forbidden West is set a thousand years in Earth's future after a global catastrophe. Thousand People years. live on in primitive tribes, but they're no longer the dominant species. Giant, animal-like machines now roam the land, and they are extremely dangerous. The machines aren't the only threat in the Forbidden West. A strange red blight is spreading across the land, and it won't be long before it strangles all life. Aloy, our hero, is the only one who can stop the blight. But to do that, she and her companions will have to comb through the ruins of the old world to find the technology they need. In this quest, Aloy has sent her loyal friend, Erend, into the remains of San Francisco to find a crucial piece of technology. Erend encounters raiders from a rebel faction of the Tanakh tribe. They are vicious fighters, but even worse, they've acquired the power to override machines. To rescue Erend, Aloy winds up fighting them. But first, she must cross the ruins to reach their camp. We face a lot of obstacles as we traverse the ruins of San Francisco. To overcome them, we've given Aloy some great new tools. Using the focus scanner, you can highlight spots that allow free climbing anywhere in the open oh, world. Wow. The pull caster speeds up climbing and can get you quickly out of trouble. The shield wing allows you to safely descend from great heights or surprise oh, enemies that. from above. The environment's just destructible. Mm. With the diving mask, you can stay submerged as long as you like. A and lot take of games your time to plan a path really around amphibious machines or boost through strong underwater currents. And to speed up overland travel, a variety of machines can be overridden and used as mounts or in combat. Combat in Horizon Forbidden West puts a strong emphasis on tactics and player choice. For close range combat, the spear is an excellent option. There's a range of combos that have different uses and effects. Valor Surges add a unique set of special abilities, one of which can be used to knock back nearby enemies. The spear can be charged to create a high damage effect that can take down even the stronger enemies. A wide array of different weapons is quickly accessible via the weapon wheel. A slingshot with adhesive grenades to temporarily stall machines. Mm -hmm. Rows with that arrows that can strip armor and expose weak spots. A powerful launcher that fires spikes that explode on impact. Smoke bombs that temporarily blind enemies. Or you can pick up weapons shot off from machines. The full game has many more unique weapons, and each of them can be upgraded on I do a workbench. Like that. But more that on that another now. time. <laughs> The, the player will need actually. to be smart and creative and use all of the combat options we have shown to deal with a large variety of deadly machines. Sun wings in the sky, claw striders and tremor tusks on land, step moss in the water, the even the seemingly big. harmless burrowers that you saw the briefly swim by. As well. They but are this all one. dangerous and even more so when today. overridden by human rebels. Uh, yeah, you can, you can, you can the take surface long to the play that game. Depends as Aloy will fight them in how much many you want to explore and do like lots of side quests. And to defeat and them, she must explore the open world to uncover the secret behind their power. And how that secret is related to her quest to stop the blight. And this is just one of the mysteries she will unravel as her journey through the Forbidden West takes many twists and turns. It's time to wrap it up. We will have more updates closer to launch and everyone here at Guerrilla can't wait for you to experience the full game. Thank you for watching. Thank you and hurry up and release it. <laughs> <laughs> like at least be this year because PlayStation exclusive. Yeah, PS4. And PS5. Yeah, at mm. least... Um, at, at least if they get it out this year then that'd be great 
But yeah, that looks amazing. Those, those graphics and lighting effects. Really good. Looking forward to that game coming out, aren't we? Yeah, definitely purchasing that one. Another PlayStation exclusive. Which the price range will be? Oh, easily they you know they're charging the seventy pound price tag for all these PS Five mm -hmm. games. It's not good. <laughs> but in saying that, it's um, their development costs are a lot higher and next gen. Yeah, limited. But I still think seventy is seventy is too much. Yeah. But you pay the prices, though. We do. <laughs> <laughs> That's a uh, Horizon Forbidden West. It looks amazing. We'll catch you in the next video, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.